Alberta's premier not backing down for comments he made during a secretly recorded conversation. In fact, in an exclusive City News interview, he's doubling down. Jason Kenney says he thought about resigning back in December, but decided he needed to run to keep who he calls lunatics from running the asylum. But who exactly is he talking about? On Monday, I announced a huge new Walmart investment, 300 plus jobs. I go on my Facebook, first comment says, Kenny, you are in cahoots with Walmart to traffic children on their website as part of the World Economic Forum. And like uh, uh, somebody on my website saying, you and the entire great reset, can, you, you will be brought up on charges and executed following the Nuremberg trials. We've had protesters at my health minister's home calling him a mass murderer for promoting vaccines. We've had nooses left on the homes of MLAs. We've had death threats against my 83-year-old mother from these people. Now, I'm not suggesting that everybody, like, the, there are a lot of mainstream conservatives, or I should say just regular Alberta people right of center who are frustrated with COVID restrictions and, and have various grievances with me. That's fine. I accept that. I welcome it. And I'm not characterizing that. But there is this marginal group who would normally never be involved in a mainstream conservative party who are trying to get involved now. And, and I'm just basically laying, laying out the battle lines that we will not allow this party to be hijacked by people like that. Right. But I guess when you, when you see that happening, is it demoralizing you being the UCP leader and having, uh, you know, those comments made? Yeah, it is. I'll be honest. And a, a lot's being made of this leaked tape of me reflecting on whether I, over Christmas time, whether I should run or not uh, for this leadership process. And part of it is, is that I'll be, I'll be very honest with you that that this is personally very difficult. To catch the full exclusive interview with the Premier, go to citynews.ca. In Edmonton, Safe Kaiser, City News.